Welcome to a short demonstration of ESDA Principles of ESD Control. This course is an excellent introductory level ESD training program developed in partnership between Automated Learning Corporation and the ESD Association. As with all LearnTech courses, you can install this training on your local area network and take advantage of the many benefits of the LearnTech Automated Curriculum Manager. This course is organized into four modules that explain step by step the importance of controlling static in your workplace, how static occurs, and how to protect against discharges that can damage static sensitive electronic components and assemblies. The course comes complete with certification testing that provides feedback on every response for enhanced learning and verifies that students have understood the course content. An effective ESD control program requires workforce training on a number of specific objectives. This comprehensive computer delivered course meets standards requirements for ESD training and training records. It also provides the capability for you to custom tailor ESD training content to match your S2020 tailored ESD control program. All of the objectives specified by the ESD Association as need to know are included in this course. Using a simple interface and a series of questions your ESD experts are able to select appropriate content for your company location consistent with your procedures and training plan and the course will deliver only that content and the matching testing material. The following screens demonstrate how the tailoring capability affects the training that is delivered to your workforce. It is not intended to demonstrate the full range of objectives or material covered. Electronic components are much more sensitive than people they can be damaged, even destroyed, at levels well below 2,000 volts. Objects carrying unlike charges attract each other and might cling together. Click on two objects that repel one another. No, opposite charges attract. Try again. Right, like charges repel. ESD sensitive product must be packaged, sealed, and labeled in a protected area, and all correct procedures followed. Click on the pictures showing weather conditions that increase the risk of static charge. Right, ESD is more of a problem when weather conditions are dry. Many everyday actions generate static electricity at very high voltage levels. Did you know, for example, that simply walking across a carpet can produce as many as 35,000 volts? If your company has a testing station at the entrance to the ESD protected area, you should test your wrist strap daily. Follow company procedures. If your company has a testing station at the entrance to the ESD protected area, you should test your wrist strap at the beginning of each shift. Follow company procedures. If your company has a testing station at the entrance to the ESD protected area, you should test your wrist strap at least twice a day. Follow company procedures. A resistive wrist strap, correctly attached to ground, will continually reduce personal static buildup and is one of the most effective forms of static control. Conductive or low resistance wrist straps less than 80 kilo ohms should not be used. The resistance limits the current flow through the wrist strap path to ground if you accidentally touch a hazardous voltage source. <laughs> 